Molly, I get there's a fly. Calm your tits. Please ignore the scuttling sound. My dog has found a fly in my room and so she's now determined to capture it. But she's this big. And obviously the fly's smaller, but... Molly, he's over there. So all that aside, I have a collective haul that I wanted to show you guys. So, um, yeah, I buy stuff, I know. Molly, really? So first, I went to CVS, and I went there like a couple days before I actually bought anything, and I saw they had really good sales, and I was like, oh my god, I need to buy things. So I, I did. Um, balls! So I read a lot of beauty blogs, so when I see things from drugstores that I've seen on blogs and swatches already, I'm so like eager to buy them because I'm really hesitant to buy things if I haven't tried it or seen what it looks like because you can't really take apart packaging. Um, and so these got really good reviews and I really like them. They're the Wet n Wild Color Icon Eyeliners and they're 99 cents. Seriously? I know, I got one in brown and one in black and they're huge! Who doesn't like huge things? That was intentional. Was. Was intentional. Not retarded. Because she's driving me crazy, she's not gonna sit in my lap if you guys have never met my dog. My Yorkie Chihuahua. Molly, say hi. I saw something I had never actually seen before, but it's the same brand, it's the color icon, and this is in copper, and it's just like this sparkly light brown color, and it's really, really pretty. I like how using it on my waterline because it's not as harsh as a brown or black because it's very shimmery goldish copper. So also for Wet n Wild, I got their 99 cents nail polishes because all Wet n Wild is buy one, get one free. <laughs> So I spent, oh, I got another one. Where'd that go? They were buy one, get one free, and I bought another, but I can't find it. Um, this first one is in a wild card, and it's just this really pretty, like, shimmery purpley. This one is burgundy frost, and it's just a shiny red burgundy color. It's eggplant frost, and it's just a purple with, like, blue duochrome. It's so pretty. So I got a fourth one wild nail polish, but I don't know where I put it, um, somewhere around here. But I'm wearing it on my nails right now, and I will put, um, what it's called in down bar. It's just this really pretty true coral color, and it's so cute. So next, I got the CoverGirl lipsticks, and I, oh my god, someone told me what these were called, and I really don't remember. Um, I, there's something, but they're the CoverGirl lipsticks, and these were by something... By uh, oh they were on sale they were on sale I think I think instead of, they were like five ninety nine I think maybe um, or even cheaper than that I know they, the lipsticks themselves were just on sale so I got one in um, Delish is that Delish yeah Delish so Delish and it is it's pretty um it's like a peachy brownish nude color. I got one in kiss which I hate I hate hate this it's just this frosty piece of crap it's disgusting Ugh. then I got heavenly which I actually like a lot this one is just a I hit the top of it but it's just like a light pink berry mauve color so all in all these are decent lipsticks I like the opacity it gives but um I hate the smell. I found that I really cannot stand the smell of drugstore lipsticks. They really do smell like grandma. Uh, no offense to grandmas. Uh, it's just just not what I enjoy smelling. I just really hate it. They smell really cheap. They smell good. Not a fan of them, but um, I really like how these apply, and I really, really like them. And I have a blog post with swatches on my lips, which I love looking at blog posts that have lipstick swatches on the lips, because like, I, really, I don't care what it looks like on your hand. I'm not wearing lipstick on my hand. So I have that all swatched on my blog, so I will link that post down below. So the next two are from Rimmel London, and they were buy one, get one 50% off. And this is um, the first one in vintage pink. And this one's a very unique color for me. I heard a lot about this. It's just a purplish mauve color. It's really, really pretty. It's going to be perfect for fall and winter. I'm really not ready to wear it yet just because it is so, it's not very dark, but it's a lot darker than I typically wear on my lips unless I'm wearing a red or something. So it's something I'm going to have to save for fall or winter. And this last one is in pink chic, which is my absolute favorite of all the ones I got. And it's just this really, really pretty medium toned light pink and I love it. So those are also featured in the blog post, so make sure you go check that out so you can see what they all look like. So my jewel mint for September came, and I am so excited. I've never, ever been more excited about a piece, ever. Like, literally, it is so, so, so pretty. If you guys don't know what jewel mint is, if you are living under a rock or something, it's a um, subscription where you get $30 and you get to 
get credits or you can buy one piece of jewelry each month with that and um, you can take away if you don't want to be billed for that month or anything like that. But it's all handpicked by Share Culture and Kate Bosworth, which I think is awesome because like Kate Bosworth is like the coolest person ever. She's like such a fantastic trend. And the best part about this is you can take a style quiz. And for me, sometimes with this like style quiz things, I'm always like, what, you're not going to get my style right? But like as soon as I took this one, all the pieces they show me for my style are like literally dead on dead on like me so I absolutely love them and I got this oh my god they're so pretty oh my god look at those earrings they fell basically they're these gold earrings that have got these black stones and then little teal drops that hang down I think they're gorgeous they're huge which I love I love love big earrings and I think they're so pretty and I cannot wait to wear them and oh my god I'm obsessed obsessed and I will link the direct link to that product down below too because I'm obsessed with jewelry because it's so next is something I tweeted about and everyone was so amazed by me. And I know, I'm amazed balls. I'm amazed, I'm amazed. I went to Abercrombie and first off, let's take a moment to admire the sexiness of that. Like low rise, I don't know what below there. Mm, am I allowed to say this thing's 18 now? I'm allowed to make dick jokes, big dick. God, I love the smell of Abercrombie. It smells like sexy man. I was shopping with Sydney and Jerry and we were walking by Abercrombie and I'm like, let's go in. And they were like, why? And I was like, I don't know. Let's look around. Let's see what I was like. Worst case scenario, we can just smell like nice boys and just look around at the hot workers. So they were like, okay, fine. And I walk over to the jeans and it was like 50% off red lines. And I look at this first pair I grab and it's like $50. I'm like, 50% off $50? 25 bucks for a pair of Abercrombie jeans? So basically how the sale worked is they had their full price and then they had a red line off of that. So they had a discount and that was marked in red. And so then on top of that, you got a 50% off discount. So I was literally amazed and I tried on a whole bunch of pairs and I actually ended up getting two. So when I finally look at the price of these, I'm expecting them to be $25 each. No, 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 they were not. So I got this first pair, which is an Emma in a size four regular. This one's actually a little too stretchy, so it sound, feels a little big, but they'll be my comfy jeans. Um, and they're just these bootleg dark wash jeans. Very, very classic, very cute. I really like how they look on. So let's let's look at the final price. Do, do we see that? $12.90? I paid half of that. I paid like six seven dollars for these jeans from Abercrombie from the Abercrombie store I know. this next pair I am literally crazy 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 in love with these exact kind of jeans that I was on the lookout to get and they're so cute they're also the Emma and but they're in a four long which is good because I need the long but the other one didn't come in long and they are just these skinny light wash distressed jeans Oh my god, they're so, so cute on. I absolutely love, love, love them. This one was $19.90 half off. So I, I, I paid 10 bucks. So I'm thinking, hey, I'm going to pay like $16, $17, $18 for these two pairs of jeans. I go and ring them up. They were $13. There was some additional percent off that I just didn't know. How freaking awesome. So that is my little collective haul, and I hope you guys enjoyed. I am sorry I have been doing so many hauls, but we're going to get over it, right? We enjoy it, don't we? Lie to me and tell me you enjoy it so that I can still continue to go... <sighs> what was that phrase I made up? Pretty bitch broke. Pretty bitch broke. I mean, isn't that the way to live life? I think so. Deuces!